Hi guys, Mad Tomato here. Welcome back to SimCity 2013 and our pretty profitable city of Static Fossilton. Uh, last time we got the oil going. Um, and the first thing I'm going to do in this uh, this part is actually go ahead and... Ooh, what is this? Oh no, I thought that was a new building, but no, it's just the cargo thing at the back. going to go ahead and build a refinery. Right. So, before that... Shut down. Right, what are you? Plastic polymerizer. Great. Okay, so do we want to make fuel or do we want to make plastic? I think we want to make plastic just in case we decide to go down the processor route. Uh, right. Yeah, unfortunately, not really the best position for this. If I. Uh, there's that one. Is there like another place I can put this? Here. No. So in the end I'm still only going to have three. Well, because that one just has to go over there. I don't think I can get another uh, refiner in here. So I may as well just go ahead and build all four of those then. Right, and get a signpost somewhere over there. Right, okay, so that's shut for now though. And of course this might get pretty full pretty quick. Uh, so what I might end up actually doing is getting another trade depot somewhere. Not entirely sure where, but we've got to get something else going here. Or is there any more room over here? No, there's no room here. That's a real shame. Because otherwise, I get you know, coal or ore. Let's go ahead and get rid of the ore one. And I want um, probably an extra crude oil storage lot, actually. I think is probably what I want here. Because it's, it's going to be the oil that's going to... It's going to be a lot of barrels down the drain, that is. A lot of oil that I've just thrown away there. Uh, but basically, you need to start working. And over here, you need to put plastics. There we go. So instead of for 9,000, we export for 21. So that's over there. And then over here, I've got extra oil. So with this oil, I can actually go and export any excess oil that we produce. And there's going to be a lot of it. So hopefully all this crude oil should now come over here. And with that in mind then, uh, I'm probably going to get some more homes in this area. It's like sewage is taking a hit as well. But I need to get some more homes up first. Otherwise, I'm never going to be able to pay for this. There we go. Right. Sewage. Keep on going. And uh, basically, we just need another one over on that side. Uh, I took you back. We need a little bit more than that. Uh, no matter what we do here, we're going to wreck some homes. That's annoying. 
Right, okay, so that's our sewage sorted. Uh, what about power? We're starting to run extremely low. Let's just build both of those. Okay, we're actually operating at a loss now. But I think the actual problem is that we're running out of coal. Are we still operating at a, a limit here? Wow, okay. Um, I think the only way around that is to upgrade power plant. Which is double... Okay, um, let's pause. Coal's got to go. We have to build a bigger power plant. I mean, nuclear is a possibility, but we need educated people for that one. So let's go oil. Put it over there. Right, so don't sell power. Uh, we'll turn global deliveries on as well. Uh, that's a lot. Right. So there we go. So we only need two of those. And we're still doing okay. Shall I get another one? Just to make sure. I think we're doing okay. We're in the green. We get up something else to help. Uh, I'm not really sure what though. I don't think that's going to work out. Um, and to be honest, what is actually happening with the ore at the moment? Right, you are full storage. What do you mean no coal? Close full storage. Simple matter of traffic then, isn't it? We can't get it out. Right, no coal. You're full. And you're full. So where are the trucks? Let's have a look. Where are you actually going? Why are you going up there? Yeah, that's confusing. There's a coal truck gone all the way up there. There's another one stuck in traffic. Okay, so a lot of this is actually traffic. Uh, because over here, we're using coal locally. I may actually have to import this. Right, import the coal. We need it. But then it's not going to make much difference if it can't get here. But we're going to have to because... No, it's not the best idea. I know. Export. You, you use locally. It's actually not the right idea. Let's uh, try and get another truck in. Oh, yeah! There's actually only two trucks. Because the trade depot was here. But... Because I moved it, I forgot that there were only two trucks. I think we could do with an ore storage lot over here. Uh, right. Change that to an ore. There we go. Right. So change that to an ore. No, no, no. What the hell? 
Manage global market deliveries, there we go. And the ore, I'm actually going to export that as well. Uh, because I'm going to go ahead and build another ore mine over here. Right, we don't need too much here, to be honest. I mean, we literally... Really? Um, okay. That's actually in completely the wrong place. Just to be further down. mine. Right there. Take that. And like that. We just need the three. Doesn't matter. Right, let's get all the trucks. There we go. Right. What's going on? Water shortage! Yes, indeed. But the problem is, I cannot build another one of those because this is running dry. We're going to have to build it somewhere else. Where exactly? Ink. Uh, a bit close there uh, to the coal mine. It may have to be over here. I'll put it at the back. Okay, where can I actually fit this? Good, I can probably fit it over here, actually. Right, let's turn that off. Direct this. In actual fact, it's probably it's not straight, though, is it? Is it going to be able to get over there? Hit some of it. Should be okay. I can build another one on the back as well. So let's do that then. And this one down here needs to be destroyed. A lot of people are leaving. Too many deaths. Too much crime. Too much crime. The amount of abandonment is incredible. Right, we need to deal with this. We're running a lot on export, so we could probably be okay actually getting the police in here and sorting this out. We have to operate fully on um, tax money. We are actually losing money anyway, but let's go ahead and sort this out. 164 crimes committed per day. Right, I think we'll run on the two the two smaller ones again. Right, you we need to spend a lot of money on this. Each one of these costs so much money. Right, that'll do for now. And the five coal. Right, so eventually we're operating on a loss at tax money. It's a lot of crime. Okay, another police station. There. 
Yeah. Lots of patrol vehicles. In the end, I think we're making a lot of money on sales, so we should be okay. Right. And of course, eventually we can uh, we can drop some of the uh, facilities because people will get better. Uh, we'll be able to sort the crime out. No one's going to school though, so that's actually an issue. I don't even know what these guys are. Are these like people who are just packing up and leaving? Or are they crimes? Thieves, I suppose. Alright, people are currently burning to the ground. Okay, right. Make sure I'm bulldozing the right ones here. Yeah, a lot of this is thieves. Right, okay. So, new buildings popping up, and hopefully, we can deal with this crime. We've got lots of cars out on the roads. Oh, did I wreck a piece of road at the back there? I did. Come on, replace the bloody road! Thank you. I think these also need to be upgraded to three lanes. These are very, very heavy. Uh, this bit of the top, not so much, I don't think. But we'll still uh, we'll upgrade it anyway. This bridge also. Uh, particularly this. Make sure that... Right, we'll go we'll go all the way up to here actually. And I need to bulldoze that. And we'll replace it with something else. Let's go commercial. A little bit up there. Right, so exports should be happening, which is good. I can't actually select that particular ship, which is a bit of a shame. Just to see what it's carrying or something like that, that'd be quite good. Fire coverage. Small fires everywhere. Okay. Anywhere in particular I can put this without knocking something down. Fine. It's going to have to be. There we go. Need fires, fire coverage, because, like it says, city burning down. Right, not so bad over here, actually. It's quite okay. There's still quite a few fires. Right. Sort that out. What about our clinics? You're doing okay. What about the other one? Where's the where's the other clinic? Yeah, you're doing okay as well. Okay, it is a big disaster. All right, let's deal with those. Right, how are we doing? Still, 164 crimes being committed. Police cars are everywhere, though. They're all stuck in traffic, though. That is the problem. They're all stuck in traffic. But we're making lots of money because of these exports, so we paid off those bonds as well. They're all done. Right. Okay, how are you doing? Right, good. I would like to get the Trade HQ up as well. Uh, 
that over there. Then you have like a signpost. Yeah, you do. Right, good. Right, let's put that up. HQ upgrade is automatically available. There we go. So what do we want to do? Um, we don't really need you. The electronics division is possible. Models. I don't think we really need it because uh, we've already got like quite a few uh, electronic. I mean, we're we're not going to be able to get into the electronics because, um, well, we'll never be able to get the processors. Uh, I mean, the TV thing's available, but uh, it means we have to import processors, which is not necessarily the way to go. I think we may have reached the point where we can't do much else with this city. Okay, so that is pretty much it then, to be honest. Uh, we got a total 308,000 people in the region, which is not that great. Uh, but overall, I think we've done a pretty, pretty okay. I think I'm still, I'm still learning quite a lot about this game and about the city specializations. But uh, managing the money is still proving quite hard. But however, we're we're exporting so much stuff here that in the end the tax base doesn't matter because we're we're still in the profit. So overall, this is actually a successful city. Uh, oh, we can actually. It doesn't tell you what's on it though, which is a bit of a shame. So overall, this city I feel is a success despite the horrendous crime. The number of crimes is going down, which is good. Thirty-seven deaths per day. That's still quite a lot. Uh, buildings burned down 16, that's still quite a lot. Garbage situation is good. Uh, I think we've managed the sewers quite well. We've managed our utilities are actually doing really well, so that's not actually a problem. Uh, yeah, the real problem in the end was actually, um, was actually the traffic, which seems to be a horrendous problem with this game. Um, I can't seem to solve it at the moment. Maybe I should spend a bit more time actually looking at it, but, uh, uh, I wish this game had one ways because one ways would solve a lot of this to be honest um, and I would uh, certainly some of these junctions I would change but also the city size as well it's very small so you have to try and cram a lot of things in and stuff like that but uh, overall I think this city has been really really good um, as a region I think it's been okay uh, I'm a bit disappointed about the great works failure though but uh, at the end of the day um, well, we we needed um, we needed more stuff. So in the end, uh, I think we should reserve the great works for uh, a larger. I'll, I'll go I'll go ahead and say a larger region, but it's like a region with more cities in, so that you can use two cities to send the same thing over. That would be quite good. I mean, we could have potentially done it with static fossilton. We could have made metals, sent all that over. We could have then made um, alloy, we could have switched and sent that over. Uh, that was possible as well. So we could have potentially done it, but I felt that we were basically having to change specialization all the time with the same city, and I felt that's actually quite hard. Um, and I've not really got uh, any experience with doing that at the moment. So, But there we go. So that's been it for this region. I hope you've liked Statica. Uh, next time we will start a brand new region and we'll see exactly uh, we'll see exactly how well we do with uh, subsequent regions and things like that. Uh, hopefully we'll get to play some multiplayer as well. But for now that's it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time for more SimCity 2013 with myself Matt DiTomato. Thanks for watching guys.